Will FCC meet? Jeff Birding provided clarity today on his West End intentions. He stated clearly nothing's been signed for an option on land and that any worried West End residents can rest easy. There's many parcels down there that could work. Uh, I will say we have no interest uh, uh, in, in taking away homes, buying people's homes. The president and CEO of FC Cincinnati has a deal already done for an Oakley location, but it'll take another two months for a traffic study to be completed there, a critical piece of this puzzle. If a traffic study says that FC Cincinnati Stadium will be uh, lead to gridlock in Oakley, I think it's reasonable to expect that people in Oakley won't really want a new stadium there. So FCC's best play at midwinter is to keep all three options in play. That includes the West End, which has garnered intense media scrutiny this week. Keith Blake is the community council president. He and other neighborhood leaders met with Birding on Wednesday. FCC has land identified in Newport and in Oakley, but controls no property, vacant or otherwise, here in the West End. We, we express concerns based on the reports that were shared in the, via media and said, you know, we want to make sure that you have community involvement in your timetable. And he assured us of that. Birding says the MLS decision-making process is taking longer than anyone expected, and though it has tested patience, just as on the soccer field at times, a little more is needed. The process is such that we'll hear something before too long. And the season starts in early March, so by then is what Birding believes if not sooner. Reporting live at UC, John London, WWT News 5.